Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So today, we are going to be taking on the new Stage 15 of Infinite Dragon Ball History versus Fused Fighters. Now, in order to clear all the missions in one run, you have to have 3 units in the Resurrected Warriors category and 3 units in the Time Limit category. Luckily for us, on this team, we have 3 units that are in both categories, and that would be the Fizz Final Form Angel Frieza, the Int Super Saiyan 2 Angel Goku, and also the uh, LR Super Saiyan 2 Angel Vegeta. So we should be good to go as far as the missions are concerned. And for the rest of the team, we have the Tech Transforming Frieza, the Tech Gohan, and also the Tech Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta. So I'm feeling pretty good about this team. I think it should be a pretty quick and efficient run. Of course, if you guys want to race me, we do have the timer above my head, so feel free to use that as a reference. And uh, with all that said, let's get ready to jump in here. Let me just start the timer on three, two, one, go. Okay, so we're in on the first rotation. We have the two uh, Super Saiyan 2s together, which is not a bad rotation, actually. So I'll, I'll probably keep that for a bit. Okay, so let's see. I'll give these to Goku, give those to Vegeta. And also a super for Gohan. Alright, let's see what happens. So we're taking a super immediately. Uh, that's not bad. That's not bad. 15k. I mean, of course, it's only the first stage. Um, I do assume it's going to get much harder later on. But we're tanking these attacks pretty well right now. Of course, when it comes to like Infinite Dragon Ball History as an event overall, it's never been that hard. It's never been that challenging, you know, at least compared to like the Legendary Goku event. I'm assuming the Legendary Vegeta event is also, you know, pretty challenging. And that is probably coming before the end of the year, so I'm pretty excited for that. Damn it. Okay, so we weren't able to kill the Gotenks on the first rotation, but that's okay. Uh, let's see here. Oh, these, these links are not good. The orbs were not good either, so we're gonna have to waste an attack with the Frieza first. And then the Vegeta should definitely finish off Gotenks. But yeah, we're just wasting time. We're racing, right? So I'm trying to get through this as quickly as possible. That reminds me, I should probably turn off uh, active skill animations if I haven't done so already. So I'll check that in a bit. But you know what? We're making decent time. Oh my god, all these all these transformation animations might have been a bad idea, man. We have so many units on this team that have like these animations, right? Oh my god, okay. This might have been a mistake. This might have been a mistake. Okay, so three transformations in a row. That's done now. Perfect. Uh, let's put Vegeta there. I'm gonna give him four orbs, I guess. Let's try to get six for Goku. Oh, there we go. Six for Goku. Perfect. And then a super for uh, the Frieza. We just wasted about 30 seconds with the three transformations. They're awesome to look at. I really like them, but it's just not good timing, man. It's just now is not the right time when we're trying to set a good time. Okay, so we're getting supered here. Type disadvantage though. I'm gonna say like 50k maybe. I clearly underestimated Majin Vegeta's tanking ability. It's been a long time since I used him, so I'm sure uh, <laughs> you guys can understand, but yeah, wow, I was expecting to take a lot more damage. Um, I guess we'll be fine. All right, Super Saiyan 3 go tanks here. Uh, let's do, oh, I don't know, okay. So why don't we actually give these to the Vegeta? Um, Damn, okay, still can't get a super with my Frieza. That really sucks. But at least we can get a super with Gohan. Get him to stack a bit, but we need the, the, the Frieza to stack as well. Maybe we should put the Frieza and the Frieza together. Like the Tech Frieza and the Fizz Frieza together. Because, you know, from a linking perspective, that makes a lot more sense, right? And then I can probably just float Super Saiyan 2 Angel Vegeta. 
as you know defensively he is a little bit of a liability anyways yeah I think I'm gonna do that we gotta, we gotta change up these rotations a bit because this is also not the most efficient rotation what we have going on right now it's not the most efficient for for the race right because our damage output could be better right now okay so we'll keep this rotation as is um let me see okay let's put goku there six orbs once again that's good uh i can only get five for him but that's fine i'll give these to the frieza heal back up to close to full here get one dodge and then normal only doing double digits we're doing well guys we're making good time right now and also just tanking really well too now does vegeta get uh effective against all here or do we need six orbs oh no we do we got effective so i guess it's three orbs so what's six orbs then what does he get for six orbs i don't remember i don't have time to check though <laughs> I do not have time to check. Okay, getting supered, a type of advantage though, so this should be fine. Should be just fine. Yeah, 43k. I can definitely live with that. Alright, so we're now we're at the... Uh... There we go. Okay, now we can get the freezes together. I can finally get a super for my freaking Fizz Frieza, man. That was a struggle. His defense is at 134k. Alright. But of course, it should be a lot higher. We should have had at least two supers. It should be over like 200k at this point. But better late than never. Better late than never. Here we go. And hopefully the go tank survives, so we can at least get one more attack with our tech Frieza. Never mind. That's fine. All right. So we're on Kabito Kai now. Um. Why don't I go keep the Majin Vegeta? and the uh, Goku together. Oh, you know what? I'm stupid. The, the Vegeta, I'm pretty sure, gets the damage reduction with six orbs. I think he gets like 30% damage reduction or something like that. I don't really use these units, you know? Like, <laughs> the Goku and Vegeta, like, I, I recognize they're good, but I really don't run them too much, so I don't exactly remember what their passives are, but I should use them more because they're clearly very good. It's just, I guess, the, the problem is, like, there are too many options, right? I have too many units to choose from. <laughs> and I know this sounds like a flex, but it's not. It's not. It's just facts, right? Like, it, there are too many units at this point to use, and, you know, it's too many OP units at this point to run that um, I really haven't uh, had a chance to, to use some of the older guys that are, I guess, not as OP. Okay, uh... Can't get a super for this, Frieza, but I, I think we're not even going to get to him anyways. I'm assuming the final form Frieza is just going to kill off Kabito Kai here. Oh. Oh, interesting. Okay, so... Man, I feel like this Frieza is not going to do enough damage unless we crit. If we crit, then... Yeah, okay... <laughs> Oh, oh, additional, okay. You know what? That's bad, because we're not even gonna kill him still. So now we have to sit through this animation, still not kill him. Oh my god, okay. Uh, let's just do this. Let's just do... I was gonna say let's do a normal attack, but we can't do a normal attack. Well, uh, all right. Finish off Kibito Kai, move on to Vegito, I believe. I think it's Vegito. There's at least four more. There's Vegito, Vegito, and two Gogetas. Something like that. I think it's base Vegito, base Gogeta, and then Super Vegito, Super Gogeta. Oh, okay. Golden Frieza. Beautiful. Glorious. Uh, ooh, and he's AGL. Yo, let's one-shot him. Let's one-shot him. Here we go. We got this. We got this. And Frieza one shot, or at least with the additional, two shot him. 4.6, not a ton. It's guaranteed crit though. If we get the additional here, I think we can kill Vegito. Never mind. We got the additional, but it's a normal attack. 
I was expecting a little bit more, I gotta be honest. Took 65k there, alright. You know, it's not great, but it could be a lot worse. Could have been a lot worse. Ooh, some good damage for Angel Frieza. Did I pop the active skill? Is it time to pop the active skill, or is it a little bit too early? Because I still want him to get more defense. Maybe I'll save it for like two more turns. All right, so let's give these to Vegeta. Those to Goku. Oh, we got a token attack. Okay, token attack for the Vegeta. That's fine. Should kill Vegeta here. <laughs> Close to 10 minutes. Off the clock. Three, four, five, six. Nice. And uh, yeah, this... I believe we will kill Vegito. Although, as you guys can tell, I'm not great at predicting these things. <laughs> so we could be a little bit off. Please die, please die, please die, please die. Come on, come on, come on. Thank you. Beautiful. All right, what's next? Gogeta? Oh, it's Vegito. Okay. Um. Ooh, okay. So, screw it. Let's pop this. Got the transformation, I did turn off. I should forgot to check, but as you can see, I did turn off the uh, animations, which is perfect. And we get a nice 18 key super, I think. Yeah, with the Super Saiyan 2 Angel. Uh, Vegeta getting supered, hopefully doesn't hit us for too much. Acceptable, I can, I can, Deal with that, okay. 4.2 mil, right? Nice. No additional there, but uh, thanking normals quite nicely. And I don't believe he can super multiple times, so our freeze in the middle should be safe. I mean, even if he got supered, his defense is pretty high right now, so I'm not really concerned. All right, additional 4.8, 4.8. Can we get a crit though? Otherwise, we're not really doing damage. Okay. Okay. Uh, nice super for Vegeta here. I just realized how many tech units we have on his team, so I really want to get through this Vegito as quickly as we possibly can, because it'd be a bad time for our tech units. Um. Okay. So we're gonna do Vegeta in the front, or sorry, Goku in the front. Uh, Vegeta, we're gonna give six orbs too, so he should have, he should have some good defense. Then we'll give these to uh, Gohan. Okay, so as long as we dodge the super, Goku has a 33% chance to dodge right now. Actually more because of the hit of potential, so uh, as long as we dodge a potential super, I'm not gonna be upset. Okay, we're dodging nothing. Does he cancel dodge or what? Or are we just getting really unlucky? I feel like he doesn't cancel dodge, we're just getting really, really unlucky here. Okay, come on. Decent damage. Alright. Maybe no super this turn? Maybe no super this turn. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, super this turn, but it's Gohan. So... It'll be fine. <laughs> we took 9 damage. <laughs> Oh, that was fun. That was fun. Okay, time to end things for Vegito, and then for the rest of the event, I don't think we'll have any other concerns because I don't. I don't think there's gonna be another int enemy um, remaining. <clears throat> I believe the Gogeta at the end is actually Fizz. I think it's Fizz. Oh wait, is this the final stage? I think it's the final stage, guys. Okay, um, let's pop this, of course, no animation, and I'm gonna actually give these to Vegeta, let's give these to Goku, and that's still actually a lot of orbs for Vegeta, that's actually still a 24k super, damn, alright, that worked out really well, that worked out really, really well, can we no item this, I wasn't planning to, I was actually planning to use items, but since we're at full HP right now, I was like, we don't need to use items, right? Um, hopefully it wasn't a mistake, because there's still a lot of attacks at the end there. A lot of attacks at the end there. Let's 
scaring me a little bit, to be honest. I mean, we've got so many orbs, though. Wait. Vegeta gets defense with orbs, right? Not just attack. Dude, this is... <laughs> I, I, sh I should make a policy of, like, checking. Of checking what all my units do before I start a run. Because, <laughs> uh, this is... This is not good. This is not good. Alright, let's see what happens here. Oh, 57. Okay, okay, okay. 57, 68. Okay. Alright, 67. 128. No super this turn. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna pop the active skill. There we go. So now we have Ultimate Gohan. Uh, let's leave him in the front because he's not gonna take any damage at all. Like, he's just chilling. And, uh,. Yeah, let's see what happens on this turn. Over 5 mil attack. I love this animation, man. Almost never see it just because we almost never transform the, the Gohan. But that's pretty sweet. Additional. Alright. Give me a crit, man. Come on. No crit. Still good damage, though. Can't complain. And not complain. All right. So Frieza, if one of the Frieza's additional supers, I think it's over. If not, uh, still won't be too bad. Should still only take one more attack, anyways. Fifteen minutes, thirty-five seconds. Gonna be close. Oh, there we go. Oh, we got a crit. Oh, we're, we're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, boom. And we're gonna stop the timer right now. All right, let's say 15 minutes and 45 seconds. I probably could have stopped it earlier, actually. Like, as soon as we killed him, as soon as we got the KO screen, some people might have just uh, stopped it. But, you know, for me personally, man, um, I'm not like that, you know? I like to be as fair as possible. So. <laughs> I'm gonna say 15 second, 15 minutes and 45 seconds, actually close to 46. So uh, let me know in the comments, guys. Oh, should be all the missions, yes. Boom, 23 stones, done. All right, so one run is all it took because we had the three Resurrect Warriors, the three uh, time limit. Obviously, you can have other teams, other combinations, or you can do them separately, right? You can do like time limit and then Resurrect Warriors. But as you guys know, I like the challenge. I like having to think a little bit as far as team building goes, although there wasn't really that much thought involved in this one. Um, and there you have it. Stage 15, Fuse Fighters, done. And uh, I'll probably never run it again. But that is my time. 15 minutes, 45 seconds, 93 milliseconds. How did your time compare? Feel free to let me know. And uh, that's going to do it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like, the damn video and if it's your first time watching me first time to the channel you like what you see then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the tiger squad now while you're at it hit that notification bell too so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content and that's it i'm out of here until next time have an awesome awesome day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media signing out